Stamford Bridge is the venue. I must say the weather has certainly cooperated. It's beautiful here today. I'm Derek Ray, getting ready to bring you all the action, accompanied by my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Chelsea versus Wolverhampton Wanderers. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. And the game begins. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Kalidou Koulibaly plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. And Golo Conte starts alongside Jorginho in the centre of midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Raheem Sterling. Firing it towards goal. Really good piece of goalkeeping there. The initial 11 for Wolves. Joao Moutinho plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And lining up through the middle in attack today, Raul Jimenez. N'Golo Conte. Here's Chilwell. Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Firing it in, and a relatively straightforward save for the keeper. Sterling, an effective challenge. And that was a very fine read. Smart stop. <laughs> Let's see about the delivery. Well, the clearance half hearted. Conte. And now with Havertz. Conte has it. Well, trying to place that one. Didn't get it quite right, though. And Chelsea moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Well, didn't go to plan in the end. Useful looking ball, big opportunity. Oh, a tremendous block. And Golo Conte. On to James. Conte. Jorginho. Good looking move, this. Can he finish? Good work to win it back high up the pitch. Mount. James. And clears his lines. Well, let's see if something comes of this. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. It's a good Wolves move in the making. A fine reading of the situation. And Moutinho with it. Oh, the angle was acute. Well, I don't think anybody was expecting him to shoot from there. That was really close.
Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball. But in terms of creating chances, they've been well below their normal standards. Unless that changes quickly, it's going to be a really frustrating day for them. You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Played in there. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. James. Can they forge ahead? Well, they would have done had it not been for the keeper. Well, they should be ahead now. Yes, it was a good save, Derek, but he should score from there. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London. Well, not quite happening for Raheem Sterling up to now, Stuart. Well, he's had no real impact on the game so far. Yes, he's been tightly marked, but he has to work hard to make things happen. He's been really disappointing. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Oh, great attacking play. Well, a chance here, perhaps, to invigorate their aerial targets. Who can he pick out? Oh, good save. Excellent header. Jorginho. And they keep the ball. Advantage Chelsea. Morgan gives White. And the pass could do damage. Superb stop. And a throw in here for Wolves. Well, I still don't know how he kept that out, Derek. It's a fantastic save to keep it all square. Bodies forward and the break looks on. Chilwell. Makes his way in field. Sterling to take the lead. Mount and the flag was up in good time it's offside well he should have realized that was going to be offside that's a poor decision to play that pass and smart defending Nuri, Max Kilman, it's with Martinho, and a decent position for Wolves to be in. Oh, big chance! And a goal! That will do it! They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. Well, here we can see it again, and it's all about the pace of the passing. One touch, slick movement, and when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Koulibaly Jorginho well it's one pass after another Chilwell the verdict is offside here well they've decided to make a change
20 minutes to go. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come onto them. Useful looking ball. Frantic action from one end to the other. They weren't ahead for long. And this match is level again. Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And Sterling finds that bit of space to finish so clinically. That's an excellent goal. So back underway, one goal apiece here. James. Oh, that's a pass of high quality. Well, it looked like it might lead to something very positive indeed, but a useful interception. Timely intervention. Chelsea will get the throw in. Time for a change then. Number 18, Morgan Gibbs White. To be replaced by number 10. Daniel Perez. Well, they know they need to stop him. Jorginho, is this the moment? Oh, it's mischievous. Still alive. Well, threat averted. Well, I thought that was game over. It's a great save from the keeper just to keep them in this. Well in possession now and looking to create something of their own. Oh, the penalty's been given! Late drama here, and how costly could that prove to be? Well, some might say he's been fortunate to avoid being shown the card. Well, I like that from the referee. Just because it's a penalty doesn't mean it's a yellow card. I think he's got it right. And the substitution will occur now. This to put them back in front. And a goal! He was composure personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Well, when you see this again, the goalkeeper goes the right way, but it's almost the perfect penalty. Into that top corner, there's nothing the goalkeeper can do about that. That's brilliant. A big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? The clock is not on Chelsea's side, but it's not over for them. But timely defending when it mattered. Coming onto the pitch, number 10, Christian Paulson. Well, wait, don't go anywhere. We're going to have five additional minutes. Ziyech. And Martinho with it. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, here it is again. And they've taken their goal well, but the defending was non existent. That should never happen. That's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. 
So the final whistle, and that's not how Chelsea fans were scripting it in their minds. A defeat. I wonder what you thought about their overall performance. Well, Derek, they were certainly off the pace today. Beaten to the ball in too many key areas. They need to refocus now and perform better next time out. Well, on the final analysis, it was a top-level contribution from Raul Jimenez. How many times do we say that? Quite a lot. Stuart, sum up for us what impressed you most of all. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.